Track Mania World Cup just released their first map. The World Championship got announced and Tubes is apparently the, uh, the first map. So let's maybe check out that. Do you guys think if I got a duo and I signed up for the World Cup that I could get like top, let's say top 32. I got top one in matchmaking. I don't know. World Cup might be harder. T-Bags, thank you as this well. Guy, Sigma you and Intox? Great. Yeah, I think we can make a pretty fire team. So this is, oh, I like the textures, by the way. Um, the World Cup starts for real in like November. We are currently in July. This is a long time in the future. But there's there's going to be 10 maps to learn. There's going to be qualification tournaments. Like, it's, um, <laughs> those months are going to fly by as well, I think. And my god, this is a obstacle heavy map. Because you... Uh, huh? <laughs> do they want you to do this? Okay. <laughs> World Cup on this map. Very interesting. I mean, that, that did look consistent, though. It did actually look consistent. It's a cool uh, theme on this map. And then outside dirt here, yeah. Where you probably want to keep gear four. Up the hill. And then what? Is it there and then flip down again? It looked like it. Wow. Wait, that's kind of sick. And is that the... Okay, so you need to keep speed here. You can full speed that, and with the speed... Oh, I was thinking you could water bounce. You probably can, actually. Oh. The moving blocks need to go. I'm just gonna say it. The moving blocks have to disappear, because that's not okay. The rest, though? I think plus plus. Oops. I was a bit uncareful. <laughs> Which ones are TM2 only? Also, Gerbil, thank you so much. Ooh. That is weird. You get like reset, but then you always get pushed forwards. I quite like this. As a uh, khaki champion, I think this would really suit me in, in the World Cup as well. I feel like actually trying. I really feel like actually trying. Part of the reason I started making a lot of Trekmania content is because I realized I could never be the best. I could never beat Carl Jr. But now he's on a team with this really bad player called Pack, so he's actually beatable. this uh, previous world champion and melee champion pack. So now I have an even greater chance. So we're going to discover this first and then I'll do the plugin thing. I don't really have a favorite chess opening, but I've, I've learned that there's one thing people my rating do a lot, which is called the fried liver. And God, I hate that shit. Oh, it's so cheap. Oh, it's so cheap. If you guys don't know, it's like this cheese strategy. Where is blood going? Where you... You disregard trying to, like, play regular chess and just get a cheap win. Actual, actual cheese strat. But now that I know how to defend against it, every time they play that, I'm just happy. That I get to dunk on someone who tried to be cheap. Feels extra satisfying. Uh, oh. oh, this is a good flip. That is a 109. That's a gold medal. Damn, guys, if only there was a plug-in where I could like check check medals. In vanilla Trek Mania, you can never see the author time. Once I had like so once, uh, one of my older headsets. I actually managed to sit on it and break it. <laughs> it was in a chair and I didn't see it and I just sat down on it. 
and the weight of my dumper just crushed the headset beneath my cheeks. Um, but when I told my friends, they all believe I I raged and, and actually destroyed it. When it was a pure accident. So you guys have to believe me now. It's, it was an accident. Oh, keep your four. Oh, it's like, if that just keeps speed down the wall, it's so much better. Okay, 108. 108 only? That's like two seconds of speed down the wall, I think. And then a little bit in the start. Not a lot, actually. That's almost, is it? Can you jump over the entire hill? That would make a lot more sense if you could. So here, is that possible? Thoughts? I think it is. And that would save you a ton of speed. Only spotted that just now. Yeah, look at this. Ah! It's only like two tenths at most. It's less speed than I actually thought it would. Right, so you need to go. There. That does pay off. Look at that. That's a beautiful, beautiful part of mapping, actually. To reward that line, and it's barely possible. No one asked? Okay, sorry for sharing. <laughs> I can't stop falling off, chat. Plus L, plus ratio, plus div 2, plus bad at chest, plus no headset. Saves point three. Early here. Ah, this death. No, oh maybe not. Thought touching water there would be very bad, but it was okay. Having a bad bout with OCD and anxiety right now. Oh. Your stream helps distract me, so thank you. That sounds... This guy's Sigma is... Dude. Hello there. No. <laughs> Can we remove the moving block? Can we... Could we remove the moving block, please, Nadeo, for World Cup? You're not a quitter. Enjoy it. Your journey is soon over. Think about it that way. As soon as you beat that map, you're done. What are you gonna do then? You are living it right now. You're living in the middle of progress. That is where you will find the most enjoyment. After you complete something, you are hit with a sense of meaninglessness where you search for your next project. But right now, you are living it. You're on a path, on a trajectory. You know what your goal is? So even if it takes like another day or two, if it takes a couple of failed runs, enjoy the progress that you're making. That's what I think about this map. One oh seven two. Ah, it's a one oh seven two. I wanted a one oh six. What are we thinking? That was pretty good. It was too high on the last flip. Chess. <laughs> Hop onto rapid. Right, I'll try. I'll try five more minutes. Actually, five minutes. Ooh. Because I got to lead by an example, you know? The guy who donated was so close to 25. And I just told him to not quit close to your goal. 
So why should I quit close to my goal? Outside turn. Okay, I'll full speed this. See if it's enough. That's a better flip by far. But uh, it would be 107.5. Chris, thank you so much. Please, water browns, bro. I beg you. What do you mean? It's a flip. It's a flip. It is just a flip. Are you saying there's a trick that I don't know? You could get less airtime, but I don't... Like, I tried water bouncing and I couldn't get a bounce. That does seem faster. Why did it not bounce earlier? Bro, I can do like 105 now. That saves a second. Why did no one tell me? <laughs> You all have been telling me. I probably, pro you've pro all probably been saying it. All right. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Wait. Have you have you just been sitting watching, thinking there's gonna come a point when he realizes this and he's gonna be fuming? I'm honestly impressed. I did as well as I did without this trick. fast. Okay. Up left, up left. Not enough, honestly. It's gonna be awkward drift. Yeah, okay. Wow. Great segment there. Terrible speed. I didn't land high enough. Okay, come on. Nope. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. Oh, I'll take it. It was awful in so many ways. Two seconds behind world record. Two seconds behind. I did it. Alright. See what we're missing. Much sharper. Almost outside turn, but not quite. He's gonna have like 230 here though. That ends up paying off. I don't think outside line is faster. So he had a good medium. Very high up. That looks too high. The low line kind of gets you there instantly. Saw drop one second. Oh my god, thank you for the 1.1k. I'm glad you made me uh, push for the, the 106. Good line by him there. Wide set up. I think he's like 0.4 ahead by now. It's not a lot. Oh, he, he did that full speed. Oh god, 260. I had 200. That sounded full speed. He did the entire ending full speed. That's crazy. But you see, it's like... This will be pays for second place. It's just Gurnati's ending here, I think, is absolutely on crack. Just look at that. Look at how he zooms. And now he's gone. Now he's just totally gone. He's already on the next turn by now. So it is... Yeah, I mean, that ending. But I did it. Got 106. So tomorrow we'll play the, the next map. They release one per day. So I'm going to play them all.